Welcome to Old School Geek with Edward. That's me. First things first, I want to give a shout out because I saw this awesome picture of Hermione on Twitter. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful picture of Hermione. Imagine if she were black. Here's a picture. Right? Isn't it beautiful? Gorgeous. Good work, Sophia. Keep it up. Sophia at Peace of Soul. Disney released the first live action photo for the currently in production version of Mulan. That's right. Mulan is going to be a live action movie uh, like the Jungle Book. And Liu Yifei looks fantastic as Mulan. Here's the photo. See what I mean, guys? Fantastic job Disney is doing this live action so far. I'm looking forward to it. And it looks like they're going to adhere closer to history than the animated feature, which is okay with me. I love the singing and dancing, but as long as they keep it historical, I'm down. <laughs> Okay, so they just released a teaser trailer for Captain Marvel. I'm going to watch it right now. Ah, uh, I don't know. What do you think? Leave a comment below and let me know what you think of the trailer. So I don't watch the Captain Marvel trailer, teaser trailer, again. Well, another thousand times probably. But yeah, I don't watch it and now I have some thoughts on it. So let's share those. First... Really, really proud of what Marvel did by selecting uh, Nancy Sinatra's These Boots Are Made For Walking. I can't think of a better song to match Captain Marvel, Carol Danvers, and her serious kick-ass nature. It is spot on. And so Marvel has done it again. Marvel and Disney have done it again, picking the perfect song to match the character. Which now leads me to the, the acquisition of Fox Properties by Disney and the potential for replacement for Guardians of the Galaxy. Now, we know Fantastic Four probably, more than likely, and the X-Men properties will be joining the MCU relatively soon. But there's another property that we're forgetting that has the potential to fill in after Guardians of the Galaxy moves on. And they have a connection to the X-Men team. That's right. Those in the know know what I'm talking about. Those who don't know, I'm going to fill you in. Scott Summers' father is the leader of a small little space group called, that's right, Star Jammers. So they have the potential to possibly replace that quirky team that we love, the Guardians of the Galaxy, here in the near potential possible future. What do you think? I want to hear it in the comments below. Let me know. So by now, I bet you're wondering, where is this Herbie the Love Bug hit and run footage? Well, we have a dramatic reenactment, so let's cue that now. Lo and behold, it's Herbie the Love Bug. Wow, I have to take a picture. Thanks for watching Old School Geek with Edward. That's me. And like normal, like, subscribe, comment, hit the notifications, and let's continue to have that fun, y'all. Woo!